Newland here. Uh, I've been out a couple of days, and that makes it harder for me to help you do uh, stuff like the Gravity UT homework and the Gravity quiz I want to do. So hopefully y'all use some time yesterday to answer questions either from the UT homework, which y'all can work on together, or this quiz, which y'all can work on together, which uh, oh, I guess you couldn't have done it yesterday. I literally just turned it on. Uh, but I have decided to make the quiz and the UT homework both due on the 4th of October, which is Monday. Uh, so that means that we will, you should use today for sure. And you can use the weekend for sure to both work on the UT homework questions. So if we were to just look at them, the there are only seven of these UT homework questions. Uh, about gravity, and um, hopefully between, uh, if it ever loads, you and your table mates, y'all can figure these out. Uh, looks like I messed that one up. So hopefully that'll work, but if not, I'm making Monday available to answer questions about this. The same is gonna be true for this quiz. So let me explain how the quiz is meant to work. And it's really, honestly, it's very much like doing the UT homework, uh, but I'm just trying to give us something to, to collect information on, uh, in other words, another grade. So this should be hopefully an easy one for us. Um, again, you can work with your partners on this. You can have your notes open. You can use Desmos. Um, so you'll notice that I'm in the astronomy class. I went to resources. There's a folder called tests, which I used a lot last year, and we've not had to use it this year. So this is our first foray into using its learning as a testing environment uh, in astronomy. And there's something there called the chapter three quiz. It's got two parts. It's got a pledge where I'm asking you to say whether or not you're being fair and honest and forthright. Uh, oh, well, I know it, it also says that it says, but nothing and no one else. You know what, though? Y'all can definitely work with other people. I will do my best to be honest and fair when taking this test. I will use my written notes in Desmos and, and my classmates but will still be open and clear about my work completion. Something like that. I recognize that having a window to take a test gives me, I don't know what that part is. I might as well delete that. I don't know what that is. There, so, and I'm gonna save that. Cool, so I'm gonna ask you to click the pledge that you promised to work with your teammates and do your fair share of the work. And then there's a set of 10 questions. Um, let's see, I'm gonna hit continue test review. And you can actually see what is the eccentricity of this orbit, uh, the, uh, some stuff about using the orbit stuff we've discussed before, um, some vague questions, not many of them are very mathy, a few of them are. And you know, you and your, your uh, table mates can, or anyone in the class really can help you answer these and submit that. So again, uh, both the UT homework and the uh, gravity and orbits quiz, which is meant to be a group quiz that's open notes. Um, that's both, both of those are gonna be due on Monday, October the 4th, but you should definitely use class time today. I'm not promising you class time on Monday, but I will promise you that I will answer questions about these if I need to. So that is something that we can do. You can also come to me before school starts. I don't have a first period if that works. You can come to me at lunch and ask me questions, but you can also ask me at the beginning of class, fifth, sixth, or seventh, and any of these uh, either UT homework questions or quiz questions that were super, the quiz questions I'm not going to give you a lot of help on, but I can certainly try and like make sure there's clarity on them. That also means that you have until the end of the day Monday to get both of these assignments into me. And even though that is true, we're going to make that do uh, this cycle. So it'll be on the, the first cycle. So it'll help boost everybody's grade a little bit. It should be a good way to be done with this topic. And I hope that clears everything up. All right, I will see you all Monday.